I had like two record deals, right? Mm -hmm. And they wanted your butt? Yeah. I had like two record bargains, right? And they needed your butt, no doubt enormous, except for I'm not homophobic. And I truly don't you know care you understand what I'm talking about I just yet. I'm terrible at the game. And it's presumably humorous. I would cherish attempting to imagine, like he you know loves young ladies, and carried on with the rap way of life. Actually, he's a man fan, did you realize Road is cooperating with secret hypotheses. Job with us as we dig profound into probably the most eyebrow-raising stories, encompassing industry titans like Diddy, the game 50 Penny, Wendy Williams, and Usher. And they're undeniably associated by one name, Diddy Greetings Everybody. And welcome back to Secret Life Channel. At our most memorable refueling break, the stunning disclosures about Diddy and the game's remarkable relationship. As the grapevine would have it, there could have been a few surprising tensions tossed the game's way by. In all honesty, Diddy himself yet, why you ask we should follow it back after the game spilled all on drink champs about Diddy giving him sumptuous gifts. More than two years fans were left scratching their heads. Was it simply a stupendous token of companionship or a hidden endeavor at influence? This leads us to a few frightening theories about Diddy's sexualities. I begin kicking it with Diddy Wright. I went around with Diddy for a considerable length of time, a damn close um. And this Diddy, we never went to the studio one time in investigating the reports and hypotheses encompassing different rap industry symbols. It is critical to comprehend the verifiable setting. Wherein these stories have arisen, how about we dig into Wendy Williams' scandalous 1998 hint which she provocatively alluded to Diddy's sexuality on her public broadcast. And Diddy, well, the man has charm, whether he enjoys men ladies or unicorns. It's his business, she remarked this intimation, had considerable repercussions, prompting theories that Diddy could play had an impact in Williams, losing her radio employment because of her striking investigation into his own life. We surmised divulging did its privileged insights return to Wendy sometime in the distant past her name was Wendy Williams, and she was basically copied at the stage for um discussing such quick 411. The game wound up in a detailed story interview with Vlad Television, uncovering undisclosed sexual directions inside the rap business. He nitty-gritty how certain specialists weren't uncovering their actual selves, picking trickery over straightforwardness, possibly causing well-being gambles. With the game's exposure, welcomed the spotlight back on Diddy, filling conversations around his picture, and his connections bringing up issues about whether his Casanova persona was an exterior to cover his actual direction. So in the storage room, his genuinely unnerving, you understand what I'm talking about, so we got to get into you know, get into its earnestness. And it's simply not reasonable for you know others. And afterward, that spreads in light of the fact that plugged embarrassment was another occurrence adding to these hypotheses. Yet hello, it was interested. I had an opportunity to see a few things bits of hearsay flu that Diddy could have taken part in Usher contracting in TD with ideas that Usher could have associations with similar circle of rappers. The game referenced in his disclosures, albeit speculative these speculations, keep on taking care of the continuous story about twofold resides in the music business. That is my sibling here from the very beginning we used to awaken. And I mean damn respite, yet like says, I mean I mean some time ago, when he was like 10. And I was digging further disclosures from Diddy's previous Guardian quality arrangement unfurled one more layer to this captivating story. He claimed that Diddy's late spouse, Kim Watchman, was chipping away at a detailed account book, proposing to uncover Diddy's mystery, liaisons an unexpected passing of Kim powered the fire, making individuals puzzle over whether she knew a lot about Diddy's stealthy undertakings. Kim know all his most profound insider facts, you comprehend the complex snare of tales and theories, likewise captures the game's initial yearnings to join terrible kid records and his ensuing arrangement with Dr. Durr and 50 Penny Ove. You're letting me know we gotta kick it. 
She resembles yo, for what reason? Don't we like go out to shop or something, I mean, like I paid for the game's underlying endeavors. And his mixtape that purportedly arrived at Diddy looked encouraging for a coordinated effort. Yet fate had different plans as Dr. Dre dipped in to sign him, yet the association with Diddy endured set apart by extreme gifts. And traveling with no melodic cooperation, prompting fans sorting out this jigsaw, and hypothesizing on Diddy's genuine expectations. So am I feel like an old woman tune? Was it a tangled endeavor to have the game? Adjust to Diddy's supposed surreptitious way of life, or an acknowledgement that the game had a place somewhere else, that young lady that you may be tricking could leave you, and go get another buddy who ain't gay give him the sickness, and he goes betrays her adding to this labyrinth of tales, was the game's sibling huge face recommending a more profound connection among Diddy and the game in 2022 making a buzz and adding greater vagueness to their relationship, a hypothesis about their bond being in excess of a simple fellowship, keeps the talk factory turning with fans discussing the validity of such clues, some excusing them as simple jealousy, while others viewing them as revealing the dull privileged insights of media outlets. He was with each chick, each fella, whoever he needed to be with, you know. When Kim was alive, the rich gift, the unfulfilled recording dreams, and the consistent twirling of tales around Diddy, the game, and different famous people mirror the perpetual interest and hypotheses, encompassing their lives, the game's divulgence about getting, and surprisingly, giving lavish gifts without a recording contract with Diddy brings up essential issues. What saved him around Diddy for two long years, with practically no melodic, coordinated effort? For what reason did the game feel obligated to Diddy? And what was the genuine rationale behind Diddy's liberality? We currently dig further into the trap of reports and disclosures, starting with an Instagram post in 2022. By large face, the senior sibling of the game, he indicated a more personal connection among Diddy, and the game with an image of them in a nearby hug, matched with a provocative subtitle. Perhaps it wasn't my road believability. This post stirred up the fires of hypothesis, much more strongly as it proposed their association, maybe something beyond cordial, however. A few excused huge countenances post as simple jealousy, coming from their turbulent history. It's unquestionably added one more layer of interest to the generally strange connections between these figures in the rap business as we shift our concentration to the game and Diddy's sumptuous communications. It's difficult to neglect the luxurious gifts and collaborations divided among them for two long years all, with hardly any expert cooperation. Assuming that I washed the entryway in him and a man ran out stripped, and I said that ain't no one let me know that I saw that beast in the midst of the extravagant festivals and costly gifts traded between the game and Diddy murmurs. Keep on flowing around the colorful maker's genuine embodiment and character, with a thunder of theory around Diddy's sexuality, persevering for a really long time the re-merged sumptuous brotherhood is bringing up questions covered profound inside the business, elaborate wardrobe in a new joint effort, with Devante Hines, also known as Blood Orange Diddy's verses in the Melody Trust, have lighted the murmurs around his sexuality, the symbolism of two men embracing, combined with Diddy's heart, sincere verses about dread and craving for adoration started hypotheses that the big shot may be in a roundabout way communicating his reality. This cooperation dated in 2023 remaining parts, a point of convergence, and the uncertainty encompassing the verse fills in as a significant sign of likely undisclosed real factors. And it just knocked my socks off the story is inside the unique domain of hip bounce. Where did he as cut a specialty for himself? There prowls a diligent shadow of homophobia, the hesitance to embrace variety in sexual direction is an obvious part of this industry, establishing a climate of dread. And concealment, such a backward mindset, is intelligent of the difficulties looked by craftsmen like Diddy, who could hold on to truth, hushed by the gamble of cultural and proficient exclusion numerous opposition between 50 Penny and Diddy, 
is famous the tenacious allegations from Fifty Penny. Stressing his feelings about Diddy's sexuality have been a common subject in their collaborations, quite in a 2018 appearance on The Morning Meal Club. These combative declarations, while exuding from private matters, add to the conundrum, encompassing Diddy's life revealing insight into the Duggan viewpoints inside the business, Diddy's affirmation of his fights with wretchedness, in 2019 further enhanced the reports about his sexual direction, the flood of help and urgings from fans for him to embrace his reality. Underline the developing discernments about sexuality and psychological well-being in contemporary society 